right, guys. Red Bearded Marketing here with local business spotlight interviews. Today, I'm down here at Shoot Angry with Jeff. So Jeff recently opened up the other weekend uh, down here in Douglasville, which I used to live right around the corner. So Jeff, tell us a little bit about what you specialize in here. Besides just selling guns and ammo, dude, you, you do some cool stuff. Uh, I've seen some really cool custom jobs. Tell us about what your favorite thing to do here is. Um, so my favorite thing to do is build and uh, customize and paint work on the ARs, any ARs, AR9, 10, 15, you name it. Uh, I do it. That's pretty much my specialty. Um, but in addition to that, I do gunsmithing, um, maintenance, cleaning, um, you know, like I said, paint jobs, repairs. Um, yeah. So yeah, I do a little bit of everything. So we'll, we'll be getting a laser engraver in here pretty soon. Oh, sweet. Uh, yeah. High end laser engraver. So, you know, it's not your little, put it in your garage and right. engrave some numbers on there. Um, we'll, we should be able to do a whole lot of really, uh, really cool things, including stippling of grips and mags and oh, wow. yeah, all, all kinds of stuff like that. So yeah, pretty excited about it. So how did you, I, I know I heard the story, but how did you come up with the name? So the name came from, uh, the, my buddies up at the, uh, my local gun club. Um, when I first joined the club, I had never shot trap before mm -hmm. and they were pushing me to get into shooting traps. So I went and got myself a shotgun and uh, started shooting trap and you know it took me uh, you know it took me a year maybe two years to get to the point where I was shooting 24 out of 25 birds and I'd always miss that last bird it drove me crazy and I, I'm a very competitive person especially being competitive with myself um, so it got to the point where I was hitting that 20 or I was dropping that 25th bird constantly and I'd get I'd get ticked off you know right. um, so they called they started calling me angry Jeff so um, fast forward to the point of me starting to open up a gun shop and, uh, yeah, the guys at the club were like, Oh, you should call it shoot angry. So we went with it. You know? right. We went with it and it, uh, you know, it's really stuck out and, uh, grabbed it, you know, caught a lot of attention. So That's yeah, funny. I like it a lot. That's funny. Cause my, my, uh, my name for red bearded marketing, when I started doing what I was doing, I had a number of clients and I got to the point where I had to form an LLC because I was making too much money to not, it was stupid not to. And I, you know, my accountant said like, come up, we got to come up with a business name. And, and I was sitting there scratching my head for like a month and a half. And I was literally just doing an Instagram post and I was like, just kind of marketing myself saying, Hey, I'm doing web design. And I was like, red beard, beards, red beard marketing. And I just started like crying. I was laughing so hard because it was literally... <laughs> Right in front of my face. Yeah, right. <laughs> like right in front of my face. It was my face. And I just came up with it and just started, you know, I was laughing for like five minutes. My ex thought I lost my mind. Uh, <laughs> she literally yelled in the other room like, what are you doing? Yeah. She was worried. Yep. She was worried I was up to mischief. But uh, yeah, it's funny how sometimes how um, names for your business and your career, like what drives you to live and live a new lifestyle. And Because yeah. being a business owner is... As you're you're learning, it's there's so many hoops you gotta jump through. Oh, there's, goodness, yeah. there's so there's so many days where you just gotta <clears> keep <throat> your head up and keep trudging yep. and kind of put your mind back into the into the place it needs to be. Mm -hmm. But it's really funny how sometimes you just kind of stumble across a name. Yeah, yeah, it was it was I, I liked it a lot. It, it stuck, and then you know the abbreviation to SAI, you know, spelled Sai, and I thought, oh, that's you know that's pretty cool too. So we actually ended up going with two logos. You know, the shoot angry the skulls with the uh, Crossbone, you know, belted ammo right. and the, the uh, abbreviated Psy logo too. So, awesome. yeah, pretty cool. Oh, hey, hit that subscribe button. All right, so what kind of custom builds are you doing? Uh, and what have you done in the past? I know you did one for my friend Sarah. I can for what was what was that build that you did for her? Uh, that was a Beretta 92 FS. Um, so she wasn't sure. Um, what kind of pistol she wanted. So I took her to the range and I essentially just brought 10, 15 pistols out there and I said, Hey, let's shoot. Let's shoot. Let's see what you like. Let's see what you don't like. Tell me what you're comfortable with. And she settled on the, the 92 FS. So we ordered her a, uh, a the, the pistol and uh, she decided she wanted custom paintwork on it and she fell in love. You know, she, she liked Tiffany Blue. So um, we ended up doing, yeah, we stripped it down, bead blasted it. Um, degreased it, all that fun stuff and, uh, did her a black and, and Tiffany blue Beretta and she fell in love with it. So 
a couple days before the grand opening, I took one of the custom ARs that I did and decided, you know, hey, this has been, you know, pretty popular. Let me do an AR in Tiffany Blue. Um, so she called wind of it before the grand opening and messaged me and was like, Hey, it's sold. I'm going to send you money. Market sold. Don't sell it. I want it. I got to have it. So but, yeah, yeah you, know. you didn't tell me and I sent a picture of her and she was just like, it's mine. Don't touch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, uh, you know, many more can be made, but as far as custom builds, uh, aside from ARs, you know, I can do, um, 1911s. Uh, Glocks, SIGs, things like that, all custom work. SIGs and, and Glocks and ARs, they're, you know, in my opinion, they're kind of like Legos. You buy parts, you put them together, you know, you build them the way that you want to build them uh, or the way the customer wants them built. Um, but as far as the 1911 goes, there's a lot of, uh, of labor and attention to detail that goes into that. There's a lot of filing and fitting and polishing and, you know, getting everything to run smoothly. Um, but, uh, yeah, when I build the 1911, there's, there's no slop. Gotcha. In, in any of that. So thanks for having me, man. Uh, he is located down here in Douglasville, so tell them uh, you have any closing outros. I just want to thank everybody um, uh, who's been you know, instrumental in helping me get this going, and all the customers that have been down here and future customers, thank you so much for your support. It means a lot to me. Uh, I'm really excited about this, and I'm really excited about meeting all you folks. All right, guys, so come on down to Douglasville and see Shoot Angry. Maybe uh, buy something nice. Awesome. Cool. Be safe, have fun, and learn something, folks. Okay. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, thank you, man. This is the Beards Channel. Follow me while I'm on my adventures, meeting new friends, and living my best life. Exploring this world and everything it has to offer. While getting some good food. So click that subscribe button. I dare you. <laughs>